Okay, testing, testing, everything looks good. All right. All right, so now it looks pretty good. All right, so now I just have to stay focused. All right, so I want you to ma imagine that you're guiding my hands as I cut the deck into three, uh, three piles, okay? And uh, just uh, you're guiding my hands. Just focus on your issues, okay? And you're kind of guiding my hands as I cut the cut the cards into three piles, okay? Okay. Okay. And now we're going to deal three. Three. Uh, we're going to deal from deal you a set of cards, okay? Knight of Wands, Ace of Wands, which is not bad, and we've got the Strength card, and now we've got the Hierophant. And the uh, two of cups, okay. And so let's see. Let's just move them into place here, so you can see better. Okay, can yeah. you see that pretty good? Now let me just arrange the. There, there we go. There we oh, go. That's perfect. Right. Good. good. Okay, so let's take a look at these cards. Well, the Knight of Wands uh, is about action. It's uh, uh, again, it's an action card. It means you're moving forward. In your move, your life is moving forward, uh, and it's uh, your life is moving forward in a new beginning, some kind of uh, creative new event or new, new. Uh, it could be it could be both uh, money or business. You're moving into a new venture, okay? You're moving forward. Your life's moving forward into a new venture, okay? And again, this is the uh, your inner strength, the strength of. Uh, it's also the triumph of your inner inner spirit your uh, also it's uh, uh, basically your inner strength and it's a triumph over love over hate but it's also about harmony uh, and spiritual power okay and again it's interesting that the higher friend is also a spiritual card and it's about uh, you know uh, you harnessing your your philosophy spirituality uh, and, and basically your inner spiritual powers as well. So these two go together. And again here, this is about uh, friendship and partnership, okay? Uh, this is the Two of Cups, okay? And that's usually about friendship, partnership. It could be business. It also could be uh, relationship stuff, okay? So that's a pretty good little, little spread there. So there's something new happening. Let's see if we've got a day for this or a date on this. Okay, I'm looking uh, towards the end of Jan. Well, it's the end of January next week. You're you're kind of in a new beginning. Something new stuff is happening in your life, and you'll start seeing more and more of it towards the last week, the last quarter of, of January. Okay. Okay. Right, let's take a look. Let's see here. Okay, uh, the Page of Wands, King of Swords. Okay. Uh oh. Five of uh, five of uh, five of di pentacles. Okay. Okay. Six of pentacles, which is pretty good. All right. And four of clubs, or four of staves, or clubs. Okay. That's pretty good. Okay. So some kind of message, uh, possibly about some kind of uh, business or legal stuff. Uh, some kind of a you know could be a, a job offer or it could be some kind of notice uh, from somebody so you're getting a message about perhaps a job offer there has been uh, there's you've been concerned about money okay that's the five of uh, five of Pentacles can mean uh, you know uh, poverty a lack of funds okay so mm -hmm. you have been concerned about money however you're moving into a uh, a new uh, period of success financial success where, and it's important for you to be able to both be able to receive as well as give, okay? And this is about being able to uh, both receive and give uh, charity, okay? And it's, uh, you know, you're, you're, you're acquiring wealth, but you're also distributing it, okay? And then, of course, mm -hmm. here, okay, which is the uh, four of clubs, which is all about happiness, success, uh, uh you know, uh, both at home, you know, love, uh, happiness at home, okay, uh, 
you know, uh, it's, 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 again, it's, a, it's, it's really satisfaction, success. So this is pretty good. So there's new, some kind of message about a new job or new, 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 new something, okay? Okay. And that's, and that's going to help you deal with whatever financial pressure that you've been under, right? And mm -hmm. you're going to, it's going to be successful because the outcome is you're going to be in a position, you know, you're going to be in a, a good position financially to both give and receive wealth and a pretty good happy ending there, okay? All right, good. let's go do another string, okay? That's uh, the Three of Pentacles, the Moon, okay? Let's take a look at this. Uh, six of Cups, which is nice. Okay, we got the Three of Swords, which, uh, eh, it's not such a great card, okay? And now let's see what else here, the Emperor. Okay, so, here we go. Uh, this is all about becoming mastery. It's about uh, acquiring skills and knowledge. Okay, uh, you're you're acquiring new skills and learning new 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 uh, uh, new new skills and talents. Okay, and applying them. Uh, this could be business or education. I'd probably business. Okay, um, be careful. Uh, uh, there may be some pitfalls. There may be there may be some disappointments. Uh, try to stay grounded. Don't let yourself get, uh, you know, into dreamland or fantasy because the moon is all about being kind of dreamy, kind of goosey-loosey fantasies and stuff because you could get led astray, okay? So stay okay. grounded, okay? All right, six of cups, again, is, uh, is always about happiness, uh, uh, security, stability, okay? So that's good. You're, you're in a good phase. Okay, there may be something that's causing you some sorrow or some sadness. Maybe it's this, uh, you, you said you went to a funeral recently. So there may be some cause of sadness or unhappiness or pain or separation, okay? I'm not sure what that's about. And again, here we go. Uh, it's time for you to start asserting some leadership, okay? And, and sort of step into your own, all right? So that's what the emperor is about, is about... Uh, you know, asserting yourself, being more uh, proactive or, or moving forward and taking taking the first step, okay? Taking, showing more initiative, okay? How are the cards? Do they come out okay on the video? Yeah, um, they're a little blurry for me, but I, I know what they look like, so I'm good. <laughs> okay, I wonder why they're blurry. Yeah, it might be my computer and not yours. Okay, I'm, I'm hoping, I'm hoping. <laughs> All right. Well, I, well, I will tell you that the one that I saw yesterday that you had recorded, the yeah. the on both sides came out really clear. So. Okay. Good. All right. So let's take it another. We'll do another. Okay. King of Pentacles, which is good. Ace of Swords, which is good. Okay. Oh, look at this. Okay. So we got a little bit of. Uh, this is good. Look at this. Okay. That's good. And now what's going on here? All right. Actually, so this is pretty good. Okay. King of Pentacles. Uh, again, you're gonna. There's gonna be a little bit of a windfall. Uh, maybe you know, as you said, you may be getting some new business, or there may be some business growth. Uh, uh, you may also be getting some kind of a gift. Somebody may be thinking of you and giving something to you, or some kind of a gift, or something may be coming up, or some kind of financial windfall. Okay, victory, success. Okay, uh, success is you're you're definitely going into a successful period of your life where things are changing and growing okay um, <laughs> it's about time <laughs> it's about time well listen let's look at this okay this is the three of cups which is all about uh you know fun happiness abundance health friendship so you know this is a good period of your you know life you, you know you've got friends there may be uh, you know a party coming up soon or just you know you're just surrounded by good friends okay this is about change this is the uh six of the swords which means uh, moving, moving away from uh, perhaps negative things, moving to a new horizon, a new uh, new new frontier. Okay, uh, can also mean travel, but it sounds more like your 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 life's changing, right? And you're moving, yeah. you're coming into your own. You're moving into a new phase of your life. Okay, and this is about uh, uh, basically you are growing in your life, and you are acquiring wealth and skill. But there's going to be a little bit of a pause, okay? Uh, so it's it's going to be slow grow, okay? You're moving forward in your life. There is some abundance. There is some changes going on. 
but it's going to be a bit of a slow grow, okay? Is that, okay. How, does, how does that sound? Okay, so... That sounds, that sounds about right. You know? All right. I, so I'm, I'm looking at probably by the end of the summer. Right. Well, let's see. Let's look at dates. Yeah, okay. Uh, well, maybe even earlier. I'm thinking earlier. This changing period is, uh, is actually... Uh, let me see here. Let me see. Uh, from the end, the, you're going to see some real changes in February. There are going to okay. be some real changes happening in your life in February. I'd say February. Again, this new beginning thing that was on mm -hmm. the previous set. Somewhere around, like, the last uh, last uh, quarter of January into February, you're going to start seeing some more changes in your life, okay? Good. All right, so let's Wheel of Fortune. That's nice. Whoops, a little bit of changes. That's normal. Okay, so we got a little warning for you here. Okay, yes. Okay. All right, so we are... Ooh, okay, so this is a bit... Now we're going to get a little psychological here for you, all right? All okay. right. Wheel of Fortune means, uh, you know, there's good luck. There will be changes in your life. But with change, change means change. So some things maybe get turned upside down, or it may seem a little bit of overwhelming. There will be... Again, this is the... That's the tower, which is all about change and upset, okay? So there are going to be some changes in your life. Try not to let them overburden you. And this is this is okay. all about uh, a pre This is the uh, ten of uh, clubs. But again, don't let yourself feel overburdened by all the changes. You know, because uh, they may they may they may kind of upset you or overwhelm you. Yeah. And again, here, uh, this is about making a decision. Okay, this is the three of clubs. Okay, uh, and again. Uh, but you're, uh, this could be a new opportunity, new business opportunity, new partnership, okay? New opportunity. So even though there is going to be some changes and it may feel overwhelming, there's going to be some opportunity. Also, this is the uh, Eight of Swords, okay? And this is all about uh, your own self-limiting beliefs. Don't let yourself feel imprisoned or trapped by your own self-limiting beliefs, Okay. Self-sabotage, you know what I mean? Throwing your own banana peels in front of you. Because if you look at the uh, look at the picture, okay, uh, uh, it's a prison of her own making. Okay? Right. She's blindfolded, so she can't, she's not looking. She's not looking for solutions, and she's trapped by these swords. So it's almost her own prison, you know what I mean? So be, right. You know, so d don't get trapped by your own sort of self-limiting beliefs or self uh, uh self-sabotage all right okay, okay so it's kind of a good change don't get overburdened by don't get overwhelmed there is opportunity you know with change there's always a bit of upset there is opportunity and don't limit yourself okay don't trap yourself by your own stuff all right gotcha okay here we go balance okay that's the two of swords two of two of pentacles the sun which is good Th these are all good okay the devil which is actually a, a lot better than it sounds or looks. Okay, all right. So here we go. Now this is again about, again, uh, you know, try and maintain balance in your life. Okay, uh, you are going to be handling a lot of new things, so there will be this sense of that you're juggling. Okay, uh, and you're you're doing a balancing act. Okay, but it is it's going to be successful. You are going to be success. It is moving into the sunlight. It is forward moving. There is success attainment of your goals there's going to be a new sense of freedom okay the devil is really about physical things it's about business okay okay it's it's really the devil you know people see the devil and go, Ugh. but it's really about physical things physical business money uh, uh, material material stuff so there is some material and also here it's going to be moving very quickly okay these changes you're going to see it's going to happen very quickly all right. This is this is the eight of uh, clubs, which is about right. swift action, moving quickly, uh, things happening very quickly. So you're going to start seeing some changes, but again, try not to get too overwhelmed. Try to maintain your balance and be adaptable because you are going to be juggling. Okay, there is going to be a lot of juggling going on. All righty. So how we doing? How you feel Good. about that? It's okay. good because I know that there's some changes coming up at the end of the month, so, okay. you know.
you go. I'm no. looking. I'm looking for a date. Yeah, it's all towards the end of end of December. End of December is going to be. Uh, well, that you've already been through December. There were some changes there. Right. Okay. And let me look else. What else is there? Um, yeah, that was December. Uh, blah blah blah. No, that's good. You're good. Uh, Sunday's going to be a good day for you. That's going to be a good day. Things. Think about nice things on Sunday. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's go one more. We'll do another string. All right. The Hermit. Okay. Four of Cups. All right. Uh, temperance. All right. And then we're going to go Knight of Cups. Okay. And uh, Eight of Pentacles. Okay. Uh, the Hermit is all about your inner inner wisdom, being in touch with your uh, your center, your spiritual, you know, your spiritual center. Uh, stay in touch with, you know, I would say, you know, it's about being, uh, you know, being thoughtful and mindful and being open to receiving guidance, okay, from your inner resources, okay, because you're going to need it. There may be a little bit of a disappointment, okay, of something. Let's see if there's a date. Not really. Okay, there may be some disappointment, but again, you know, uh, you know, stay connected to your inner uh, inner guidance, okay, and your okay. Uh, because that'll help you through there. Okay, temperance is all about being uh, adaptable and willing to handle changes and open to change and being able to coordinate and adapt to your changes. Knight of Cups uh, could mean uh, usually uh, that's an action, that's a change. Uh, that's, uh, you know, you're moving into a new period of your life. And, of course, here is the uh, the uh, Eight of Cups, Eight of Pentacles, excuse me, which is also called the Apprentice, okay? That's called the Apprentice. Uh, it, it's about uh, being prudent and careful with your money. Uh, you've got, again, this is about a new job or new opportunity, but you have to be careful and prudent, and uh, it's, it's going to require learning and, and changing. So you're going to be learning new skills, probably a new job or a new opportunity where you're going to be learning new skills. Okay. So that's pretty cool. Stay adaptable and open to learning. Okay. And again, tune into your inner, your center, your spiritual center, which will okay. offer you the guidance. Okay. To move through this new, new period of your life. Okay. So how's that sound? That's good. Okay. So. I want to thank you for letting me, uh, you know, uh, do the video with you. And uh, I'm just going to, you know, like I said, I'll post it and then you can check it out and let me know how you think about it. Okay. That sounds great. Awesome. Sounds well, great. thanks a lot. It's been fun uh, doing your reading. Thanks, TJ. I appreciate it. Okay. Take care. Like I said, I'll, I'll, I'll send you the link via Facebook. Okay. That's great.